Metrotech Aaron here. What we're going to be doing today is installing our tail light. When we get situated, we'll get you showed how to do that. So to start your installation, number two Phillips, you're just going to take out screws that hold on tail light to the fender. All right. Now the connector we're going for here, I don't know if we can see in the video, is this guy right here. Okay, now to get this off, the clip is on the bottom side. So you just push that up, and there you go. Now the taillight we're installing today is the BC HDTL7. It's just a standard LED upgrade, nothing special. One thing we do want to call out is when you get all of ours, because of the way these touring bikes are wired, they can be different. So there is going to be usually one or two wires that you have to situate. All right, and what you want to do is you're going to see on your factory plug, there's going to be some roughly the same corresponding colors. And we're searching for this blue wire here. You're going to see a little divot right there. And that is going to be pointed down. Slide it in the hole and you'll feel it lock. As you can see, clips up. Black, red, blue, black, red, blue. So we can go ahead and plug this guy in. The other thing you need to do is situate the weather seal. It's got some two-way tape on it. Pop that off. Orient your seal. Don't press it down until you're ready to commit. Once you got roughly the same spacing all the way around, sandwich that down in your hand like that. All right, now to finish our install, I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in. And that is a weatherproof connector, so we'll need to secure that. Plate light is at the top. One quick thing we need to do, on your factory light, not all of them, this bike's a 2000, it still happens to be here, which is impressive, but it's got a little retainer here. Just wanna go ahead and cut that off so you can get that factory bolt out. Grab your screws. Line that up. You want to go gently here, both sides, don't force anything. A few threads a piece. Once you got both of them in, go ahead and run it down. You don't want to over torque this because you will crack the plastic. It doesn't need a whole lot of torque. Uh, and the most satisfying part of your installs. Brand new LED light. So we're going to go ahead and turn it on. Now, not that you can tell during the daylight, but our uh, License plate light is on, running light is on. Grab you a handful of brake, and you can see that comes on too. And that's it. That's a, installing your saddle tramp aftermarket LED upgrade taillight. 